Hi my lovies, welcome back to my channel. My name is Skinny, in case you are new here. And in today's video, um, I'm gonna take with, uh, I'm gonna take you guys with me. So I'm gonna do a few things today in town. Um, I don't live in town, I live uh, far from town, so it's gonna be a distance. Um, so uh, I'm going to my school, my former school, no it's not my former school, I haven't graduated yet. I told you guys that I'm graduating, right? So um, I'm gonna go to my school because I have issues with my with finance. I don't know what the issue is because I don't have any balance. So I'm gonna go over there, know what's up so that I can be sure that I'm, I'm graduating. Well, I'm sure. It's only i think the system or something i don't know and uh as i pay for my graduation gown it's funny how we pay for graduation gowns like why do we pay for graduation gowns we have been paying school fees for the last four years and now we're paying for a piece of blood it should have included it in the face for the four years anyway it's something like fifty dollars i'm gonna go to the finance office know what's popping so that i do not have issues when it comes to um the graduation day also i'm gonna go to poster pick up a parcel guys i have a few books if you want to send me gifts i'm open for that but honestly there's a problem with that because let me tell you if you send something with poster like gifts to someone the amount of tax this government is submitting us to hmm, it's nearly half the amount. It's like 35% of the original price of the item. Anyway, I'm not here to rant. Um, I'm just gonna go with you guys. I'm dressed. I'm dressed in this. I don't know how to show you guys, but this is this is a church dress. Oh, well, something else I didn't tell you. Um, when I was in campus, um, we used to go to school with like mini skirts. You could wear like mini skirts. You could put on uh, booty shorts, you could put on crop tops, you could put on dresses, like mini dresses, like the freestyle, you know, it's it's really hot at the coast, so no one would care. But since I finished school, like last year, December, now this year, January, they set new rules, and they said if you are not decently dressed, you will not be allowed to go into the school. It doesn't matter whether you are, you are a student or you are like alumni, they really don't care. The security guard will be like <laughs> go and think about your dressing <laughs> so you're not supposed to put something that is like bare like bare top and i really have like i wanted to put on this top it's like a bare top i'll show you it's just like this is the top that you just like put on like this so basically it, you you will just zip and it will be bare if i would go like this because i had forgotten about the rules it's been almost a year and, and let me tell you guys i would go there and they would tell me go back home i remembered and i'm like oh my god i need to look for some days it has taken like two hours for me to find something to put on anyways um well so i chose this design dress it's quite it's it's long up to my knees I'm, I'm gonna show you guys so um let me head out because it's already 12 i don't wanna go and wait for them to go for lunch this will be like a wasted hour so yeah let's go Yeah, you saw that. So yeah, we're just having lunch with my friend, 
and having shawarma. Shawarma and passion juice. So guys, I'm having shawarma. This is shawarma, a Swahili snack. It has mayonnaise, it has salad, it has, I think, chicken, chicken or beef. And then I'm having passion juice and this is the surrounding. My school is just like at the far end. So catching up with you guys, it's already evening and I'm going to church. So I came home, had a shower, uh changed so we have a church service um, that is two hours, so I'm going to carry my Bible and my muffins. I just got them today, actually. Uh, I think it's um, how much was it? Seventy-five shillings each. That is like one and a half dollars for both of them. Um, not gonna carry my stabilizer because I'm not gonna do content in church. And yeah, my notebook. I'm also gonna carry my notebook and a pen. Yeah, ready for church. What else? Nothing else. So I already told you guys that I'm going to church. Yeah, my friend is coming over. We are going for um two or two hours church service. So my Bible, my notebook, my pen, my pens are ready. So yeah, after that I'm just gonna come back home. Yeah, and call it a day. I think I'm gonna continue this vlog tomorrow. <laughs> Welcome back. This is a continuation. It's, um, it's now two days later. <laughs> so I'm heading outside as you can see. I just came across. I just found out that my identity card has been used to register a number with Safaricom that I am not aware of. Oh God. I hope that noise is not too much. Can you hear me guys? Anyway, so that's what I'm going to work on because I don't know why someone would register a num um a number with Safari gone with my identity card as if they don't have the hairs. So I do not know this number and I tried contact contacting Safaricom online because they have a number but they are not picking the calls and um I think it's the best thing to go physically because I do not know when they would pick my call. And as you know Safaricom has many users so they might be busy. The primary number is the one that operates. So if you wanna make any changes do any cancellations, uh, report anything, you have to use the primary number and that is the number that I don't recognize. So every time I request to report, they are sending a code to the primary number, so they are sending to that person. Guys, I am a, I am an overthinker, so I cannot just sit here and wait. I cannot just sit here and just see it because I'll be overthinking. Do you guys overthink? Um, what? Maybe I'm crazy when it comes to our thinking. You can never be careful enough. It's only God who will protect us from this cruel world. So, yeah, I have to. Oh God, I cannot even do it myself. You see why I need my friend. Anyways, that's a joke. Um. October babies are overthinkers, don't even judge me. But I know I'll have it done today. Oh god. I'll have it sorted. Hey, why is this thing so hard? Oh goodness. Uh -uh. This thing is stressing me. 
I don't want stress right now. I already have enough. Finally, I got it done. So, yeah. So, I'm having these silver earrings and a silver necklace and this outfit and this dress. And this dress, it's sky blue. I'm loving this color, by the way. I'm loving this color. It's so cute. I love it. It's so strong. So, yeah, I have to I have to leave. What else do I have to do before I go? I don't think there's anything else. Right now, I will only settle. I only have this once that number is cancelled from my um well, it's disconnected from my id so let's go Planet Yogurt is next in Yali Center. It's a place where you can have like frozen yogurt with fruits. this vlog here because i'm already on a fresh one yeah let me know what you think about this video please subscribe like and share with your friends and i will see you on the next video